Hello, real to real fans. Today we're going to be assembling pancakes onto flanges. This is a Sade album recorded 1992 from a production master. So the first thing you gotta do is get all of this tape, archival tape off that they used to hold everything together from the years it look it doesn't really do its job that well after being shipped and every kind of thing but anyway the purpose here is to get the two uh, pancakes disconnected from each other by removing all of this tape and carefully not allowing the tape to jump off of the NAB hub because if it does jump off the NAB hub you're going to have tape salad and tape salad is nothing good whatsoever in other words once the tape jumps off this NAB hub you cannot get it back on at least I've never been able to and I have had a couple of disasters all right so now we got the two tapes disconnected so we need to get the rest of this uh red tape off which is a pain in the neck okay now we got a clean looking reel if you notice if you can see this it's a little close on this side so i'm pushing the nab hub out just a little bit to make it uh, on uh, sit on the tape better. Okay, now we have our flange and we have our tape. So first thing you need to do is get these, they all come the exact same way with this exact same masking tape holding it together. And on one of these, you will also see an A stamped or a B stamped. And uh, that indicates, you know, which tape you're looking at. You can see the A stamp. They're all the same. I mean, if it's a B tape, uh, the B tape uh, stamp looks like a B. Okay? It's always the same. Uh, so the last thing you do is you carefully take off this A piece of tape because the A piece of tape is what's holding the end of the tape onto the NAB hub. Okay, so once you have it to where it's all cleaned off and ready to go, the important thing is that you want to make sure that the tape hangs to the right side when you put it down onto the flange. Okay, then you simply line it all up, make sure everything's okay, and now we are ready for the other flange, which, where the heck is it? Oh, here it is. Okie doke. Now we have the other flange. And just make sure that you got any and all tape off. I see, I, I, this is a little, you gotta watch this because this is a little high or low on this side. But it's okay. It's all right. Put the... Uh, Top flange on, put your screws in. And at this point, you simply screw it together and with uh, these uh, tiny little uh, jobs here. I find it kind of easy to just get a, uh, uh, a Phillips piece of uh, screwdriver and then you can just twirl uh, the screws right in. And uh, it seems to go a little quicker when you're doing that. It's very, kind of fiddly with these screws, but once you do it a couple of times, you get the hang of it. Okay, and basically you screw it in. Once you screw it in, uh, then you're done and you're ready to use it. I always say it's a good idea to go ahead and label it, okay? Because then you know what it is right off the bat. So first of all, this was the A tape. 
So I'm just gonna stick, you could stick the, this A on the box, you could stick it on the tape, whatever you wanna do. Take a little piece of this, uh, this uh, masking tape and you put it on here and then you can write what the heck it is. So later on when you're moving tapes around and whatnot, you, uh, you know what it is and you label the box accordingly in the whole bit. So hopefully that gives you a good idea on how to assemble a uh, pancake onto flanges. Thanks. Bye-bye.